almost a blue steel, but with a smirk. Uh, <laughs> though I wouldn't trust it to stop bullets. Uh, what was, what was uh, for all the anime and video games and work that I've done, what meant the most to me, and or which would I want to be in real life? So, um, because, maybe because of when it happened, the first thing that jumps to mind is, is Ninja Turtles. Uh, I played Leonardo in Ninja Turtles, and it was an extraordinary experience. Again, it's something that I've been a fan of, but then all of a sudden, I get to be a part of something that's already been done, um, which is weird. Uh, but it's, it's meant a lot to me to be that character. And I thought I was going to get recast. Uh, for the first season, I was like, oh, they're going to recast me, because four kids had a reputation for doing that. And, and I just thought they picked the wrong guy, because my idea of what Leo was supposed to be was not what it actually is. And what I was doing was what he's supposed to be, and I should have just trusted what everyone was saying. Like, uh, Peter Laird, who is one of the two creators of the show, was like, yeah, perfect. He picked us, actually, uh, from our auditions. So that was also to, to, to be in the mindset, this is where it sounds a little bit corny, but uh, to get into Leonardo's head, uh, his discipline and his, his spirit, his character, he's, um, he's not the leader because he wants to be in control of anything. He's the leader because he's the most disciplined and he wants to protect his family. Uh, in future episodes like later in the season, in the series, not the season, um, you know, when the Shredder almost kills us, it, there's some episodes where Leo gets kind of dark, but the whole point is he he doesn't want to lose his family. So when Mikey's you know fooling around playing video games or or whatever, he's like, we need to be training because if we face this guy again, we could die, and I don't want my family to die. Anyway, I thought he was an extraordinarily positive character, something that was really great for me to get my head into every week, and uh, and I had a room full of brothers around me, and I grew up an only child basically. So so that was really and then lots of Ninja Turtles, but I wouldn't <laughs> want to actually be hiding in the sewers my whole life, especially New York. I mean, it stinks enough on the surface. <laughs> <laughs> I love New York. And it's pizza, Chicago. I, I have yet to have your pizza, but, you know, assuming you're all representatives of Chicago. <laughs> <laughs> it's like UN of Chicago. <laughs> um, yeah, okay, so that that's my simple answer. I could go on and on because they all mean so much to me, and I'm sure everyone else you ask is going to be like, oh, it's like picking your favorite child, but that's the first one that came to mind, and it did mean a lot to me. And it was like seven years of doing one character, which I'd never done. I mean, Dean is starting to creep up there now. now but, but we like record and then do nothing, and then record and then we're on hiatus again. So, you know, we're now, we've done four seasons of that, and about the same time we did like eight seasons of Ninja Turtles. It's because they're lazy. No, they're not. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Cartoon Network is always like, ah, oh, we've got enough. Oh, they want more. We'll get more. Ah, oh, we've got enough. Ah, oh, the fans want more. We'll do more. So, that's that. Anyone else?